something doesn't sound right. Yeah, something's knocking. Okay. What's the deal, YouTube? It's your boy TYB at Kelly and Welcome back to another video, another banger. And yes, I kind of blue balled y'all a little bit in the last video, but this time we're actually going to be installing the wheels, the stud kit, getting the tires mounted, all that, all of the above. We're doing that in this video. No more waiting. Let's go. All right, boys, we in. We and moms, we're packed to the brim. Everything, even the trunk is filled. I'm, I don't even know. It took me like 30 minutes to fit anything even in this car. Alright, we have made it back. I didn't record anything at the tire shop because it was just real quick and fast. Do me right, you feel me? They got me in and out of there. Look at the new wheels, y'all. They look so beefy. I'm a little bit worried that the 275s up front are going to rub a little bit. And I'm also a little bit worried about these 305s being back here. They look huge. So yeah, I'm a little bit worried about fitment, but you know, we'll figure it out when we get there. But before we can put it on, we have to install the stud kit first because BMW has these weird little lug nut lug bolt things for the wheels which is just completely stupid so i ended up going with this motorsport hardware i heard this is really good super simple um i got these lug these lug nuts these lug bolts um i assume that's what they're called and i got the loctite that we're gonna go ahead and put on it should be very simple pretty much straightforward <laughs> So it's been about it's been a few hours since that last fail i got that dinky ass jack uh, shout out to the homie for letting me use it it just it just it, it wasn't a, a beefy enough jacket the jacket the jacket the jacket it didn't lift the car at the end of the day so it's been a couple hours now we got this big behemoth of a jack and it should be able to lift up the car and we can go ahead and start finally got the wheel off and yes i realized that i probably should have loosened um the bolts before i lifted the car up uh thanks to him but you know we got it done either way right or wrong left or right it don't really matter i think all i have to do is put some loctite at the ends of these and then just screw them into these holes that's pretty much it i think right i just came because you said you were gonna pay me i'm not paying you shit bro <laughs> can't consider myself basic yeah this infinity pool is for bitches who get naked. Yeah. Couple shots of a Alright, I got the first set of studs on. It says it cures within 10 minutes and then uh fully fully cures within 24 hours. I just want y'all to, to really look at this image and I want y'all to remember that I actually do work on my own car. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna tighten this down with some of the Allen wrenches just so it's tighter than just the finger strength. And uh we'll go ahead and we'll put the first wheel on and finally get a look. And hopefully, I'm really hoping that this 275 doesn't rub. You know, while I'm here, you might as well clean the brake, the calipers. What the oh, fuck? fuck? Here we go. Nice. Oh, she's gonna be an aggressive bitch. She's gonna be fucking mean. It's alright, I guess. Oh yeah, look at the fitment, bud. What the fuck? Alright, quick intermission. We just realized that the tire we put on before was actually the rear. So that's why I looked a little a little mean. Actually this fitment is super flush. We might run into some rubbing. Definitely gonna rub in, definitely gonna run into some rubbing probably, but uh, she looks good. Ooh, -hoo -hoo. Ooh damn, she a monster truck, but she look good as hell though. We're definitely, definitely still on monster truck mode, but I think that looks pretty fucking sick. Hopefully, again, we don't rub too much, but we'll find out later in this video. I'm not gonna bore you with the rest of the tires, I'll check back in with you 
uh, when everything's done. All right, y'all, we finally got all four wheels on. I know the lighting's gonna be a little bit ass. We're gonna take it somewhere with lighting so you guys can get a better look. I just wanna share this moment of us letting the jack down. It's a pretty big moment for me. Hoo-hoo! Oh, yeah. Yeah, that shit player though, for real. Bro, everything, bro, she look good. Like, come on. Really? Look at me. We did this. We did this. The TYB family, man, come on. Susie is our baby, you know what I'm saying? So. She's coming along great. I want to thank y'all again for all the love. Um, let's go test her. Let's go see if we rub in the front. Um, let's go see if we tighten all the lugs. Let's go see if a wheel fall off. You know, you never know with, with us. We were some idiots. So, uh, But I think we did pretty good for just pretty much never working on a car within the last two weeks. And we just started. So I think we're doing pretty good. All right, y'all. He said we're rubbing pretty bad. Now that, do it. Keep going. Go again. Nah, that looks solid. I don't know what you was talking about. Yeah, she for sure nimble on her feet, though. I think we're good. Let's go ahead and go for a test drive. Quick little pull. Oh. I'm still spinning like a motherfucker. Still spinning. I don't know what bro's doing. Dang. Yeah, the tires aren't cold. I mean, the tires aren't warm, so that's probably why I'm spinning, but it, it feels good though. It feels good. The alignment's still nice. Look, hands off the wheel. Alignment's nice. I think we did good. Susie, do you like it? Good girl. Hey, pal. All right, something doesn't sound right. I'm going to turn around. Y'all hear this? All right, yeah, something's knocking. I don't know what that is. Yeah, that does not sound normal. Ooh, that does not sound good. Okay. All right, y'all, we figured out what the clunking noise is on the front left tire, on the front left wheel. Um, my dumbass didn't lock the studs in all the way, so the stud came loose, the lug nut came loose, and, and the clunking was because the wheel was doing like this, and it was just very unsafe. Um, big rookie mistake, but you know, you live and you learn. We figured it out. The wheel's fine, we fixed it already. Um, we're gonna go ahead and get some better shots of the car right now. But before we go, I wanna show y'all what the tire on the stock wheels was looking like. And uh, they're, they're pretty bad. Needless to say, these are pretty bald. I don't know if somebody got hungry and, uh, and took a chunk out of this tire. The fronts are obviously not bad, but the rears are, these things are just, these things are just bald to shit, bro. We already freaking we're already showing wire right here. So these things probably had about a hundred more miles, if that, on them. Maybe one Bernie, one donut left for sort of before those things just blew the smithereen. So perfect timing that we got the wheels and tires fitted on right now. Now we could drive around safe and sound and looking good. All right, y'all. We have made it to the gas station in some real lighting, and it honestly looks so much better than in the dark. Cause you can't really like just grasp it. You know what I'm saying? In the dark. Voila, here it is. You can actually see the kind of color. The beefy tires kind of make the stock monster truck suspension look a little bit better. So we have way less of a wheel gap. You know, we can, we obviously have a lot of room we could do. We can lower her like, yeah. Remember when you said the paint was okay? Yeah, 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 yeah. You thought you were gonna get paid? No. But yeah, we got way less of a wheel gap, so we're not on monster truck suspension anymore. Is it a super, my boy? Yeah, my boy. What's the deal, gang? What's good, bro? This shit's clean. Bro? Hell yeah. Thanks for my boy. Appreciate it. You too. Good looking, G. Yep. We drive safe. What y'all thinking? W or L in the comments? I think this is big dubs, bro. She just, she looks so mean, so aggressive. Damn, whose shit is this? 
You just just look at her right here, bro. She looks sexy as fuck with the wing too, y'all. Susie's coming along nice. We have so many, so many things coming planned. And I actually, I haven't made an official announcement about this yet, but I have an aftermarket front bumper. That's why I haven't got a splitter or lip or none of that because I have a brand new completely it's gonna it's gonna completely change the look some of y'all might hate it some of y'all might love it but you know it's okay either one but uh yeah aftermarket front bumper coming in January February ish and then we're gonna wrap it after we get the bumper one last look at her y'all let me know W or L in the comment section below I think it's big W's I'm proud it do match the tummy on me. I got a stable, got a blue, we catch a hell of hoes. I love some melon in the garbage. Oh, yeah, yeah. It can ask you when I'm fucking, you can tuck it, she, she can sweat it. He say he getting money, I'm like, hey, who you telling me? My dogs catch me running to a bag, I'm in the corner like a Reza. Stella got me teed up.